Eric and Ernie met as teenagers, and their partnership spanned an incredible 43 years, only ended by Eric's untimely death at the age of just 58. Now, Croydon may seem an unlikely hotspot of comedy, <laughs> apart from some of the local architecture, but it was here, at the Fairfield Halls in 1973, that Morecambe and Wise played their most celebrated stage show. I ain't got a dollar, I'm not worth a cent. <laughs> I've got a woman crazy for me. I appreciate that, sir. Will you stop playing with that bag? It's a fella, what are you talking about? <laughs> a young Miranda Hart was hugely inspired by watching this performance on video, but until now, she's never set foot inside the hallowed venue. First visit to the actual building. Yeah, Fairfield oh. Hall for the first time. Oh my God. And I hear it hasn't changed at all. No, I don't think it has. No. I've arranged to take Miranda backstage to walk in the very footsteps of her heroes. Ah. There we go, a little variety <laughs> step. <laughs> Everyone's been here. Barbara Windsor. Oh, Helen Page. Helen Page. Everyone's been Everyone. here. Everyone. Pam Ed. Jimmy Tarbuck. Mike Garwood. Oh, yeah. I can't see Ronnie Corbett. He's been here, but they didn't watch it. So it might be on this one. No, no, they weren't. I don't think it is. No, yeah. Ronnie Corbett, that's... No, no that's it might be around the corner, corner in, in the, about that side. Yeah, it's probably much it. bigger, yeah, yeah, with lights around it. Yes, yes, yeah. that's right. <laughs> there they are. There you are. Oh, my goodness. Who's the fellow with, with... The, the chins? <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> yeah. Just looking at that photo makes me happy. Yes. You know what I mean? I have to say, <laughs> wa walking onto this stage, uh, talking about Eric Morecambe, one of my comedy heroes, and you, one of my comedy oh, heroes. Oh, No, but seriously, it's quite a thing. <laughs> it is very exciting. I've got a little surprise up my sleeve for Miranda to have her arrive on stage exactly as Eric and Ernie always did, accompanied by their signature tune. So do you want to walk through there and switch your head through there? <laughs> As always, Bring Me Sunshine is living up to its name. Fabulous. Fabulous. <laughs> Brought for a tear to my eye. That's so amazing. I know. Very lovely. Sorry about the dancing. Sorry about the dancing. I couldn't help it. I'm so excited. Oh, you have a beard. How marvellous. Because they, some one of them did. <laughs> And they made a joke about <coughs> the beard. They said, um, uh, oh, look at you, you look like a coconut. Did they say <laughs> that? Yes, yeah. the man with the beard. Yeah. Oh, and then the joke was, um, but you can get a drink out of a coconut. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Paper bag trick. Oh, my God. Can you do it? Um, do it. Um. <laughs> can you do it? Uh, no, I don't, I don't think I can. You have to throw something up in the air. Don't yeah. You? You can. Well, nearly. It's always made me laugh. <laughs> good gag, eh? Good, good, good gag. gag. It's thrilling right. to see how much the humour of my generation means to Miranda. I actually can't believe this is the stage they... Did it on. ...stood on. So it's... It, yeah. It's quite moving, actually. Did you know them well? Well, or? very well, yes. And we were absolutely contemporaneous, of course. And I remember Ron and I were once very naughty. It was the Christmas show, and everybody was wondering what Eric and Ernie were going to do with the Christmas yeah. show. And once when we finished rehearsal, we walked down to look at their rehearsal room. Absolutely deserted. They'd gone for the early break. The door was open, scripts and papers lying all over the place. I thought, Ron and I thought, we, got, we could release the big secret <laughs> if we touched these scripts. That's amazing. I know. Did you have a what? sneak? We had a sneak, yeah. <laughs> and was there any sort of competitiveness between you or...? No, not just, at all, No, really, oh, good. Because we were in different... Um, different styles. Quite different, really. Uh, thank, thank goodness. Of course, what I might have to do... Yeah. ..is I might have to do the thing across the stage. That. Oh, right. Why don't you uh, go do off it. and we'll give you the music? <gasps> you You're could... making a girl's dream right. come true. <laughs> so exciting. It's pathetic, I know. Oh, okay. One, two, three, four. 